Hi, Kevin here. Well, it's Saturday, August 14th, and I'm getting ready to head up to the kitchen garden to harvest the onions. And I just wanted to warn you that I have been a very bad gardener this year. So the garden is filled with weeds, okay? I just wanted to warn you. All right, I'll meet you up in the kitchen garden. All right, here we are at the kitchen garden. So the butternut squash is doing really, really well. It's climbing up the cattle panel trellis. I have acorn squash over here. It too is doing very well. Look at that. And here, are just some of the onions. Now, onions are ready to harvest when their green tops fall over. And these green tops have definitely fallen over. So let's see what we have here. So these are red onions. By the way, red onions are great for winter storage. As a matter of fact, the only onions that are not good for winter storage are the sweet onions. Okay, so look at these, they're really big. Here's a yellow onion. Yeah, these are all winter storage onions. Okay, I'm going to pull these and then I will show you how to cure the onions. Okay, so here is just a fraction of the onions I harvested. These are mostly the red onions, but I have a lot, lot of yellow onions still to pull. Anyway, I'm, we're going to move over to another garden so I can show you how to cure the onions. Yeah, so curing is vital to winter storage success with onions. What you want to do is lay them out in a single layer on a surface that provides ventilation from below. A window screen balanced between two chairs will work, as will a mesh table. And this is my mesh patio table that I have here in the pool garden. Here's the pool. When the green stalk withers and turns brown, and when the onion bulb turns papery, then you'll know that the onions are fully cured. And at this point, you can cut the stalk off oh, about an inch above the onion bulb, right there, and then store the onions in a cool, dim, dry location. I, us I usually store my onions in the cellar and it's cool, dim, and dry there. So the onions definitely last through the winter and sometimes even into early spring. Okay, and that's all for today. The mosquitoes are getting thick. I am either going to run back into the house or I'm going to jump into this pool. All right, thanks so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.